Some people search their entire lives to try to find their purpose and their why and their career and what their passion is and what they love to do. I think teaching called me. It called me many times. I didn't know that that passion, that fire was in me, but honestly, I'm having the time of my life and it just gives me such a huge adrenaline rush. My name is Angel Mejico. I teach visual arts and art academy from grades six to eighth grade at El Cerrito Middle School in Corona, California, which is in the Corona Narco Unified School District in Riverside County. I come from a family of artists. Everyone is uh, pretty artistic in my family in different areas. It might be singing, playing music, uh, dancing, definitely the visual arts. So it's sort of in me. Art in early education, in my opinion, is vital. It is a must needed subject. With my background with the sciences, I've learned over the years that art can be incorporated cross-curricular. And for the young ones, it's important because it teaches spatial reasoning. It can teach fine motor skills. Art really encompasses every subject into one. They're learning perseverance, you know, they're learning patience. So I think it's vital for the social emotional piece as well. I didn't realize how much of every subject is incorporated into art until I've uh, done it for a while. And then it sort of the light bulb went off in my head where it's wow. Everything is dependent on each other for the overall success of this child to complete their educational experience. And here they sort of know we're fellow artists together collaborating together. It's not teacher students, so if they have a great idea, bring it to me. And I never really tell them no. It's always, um, let's figure out how. And that's the motto in here. Let's figure out how to get it done and how to make your dream become a reality. The Creative Spirit Fund Award is an amazing opportunity for our school and our students to utilize uh, such a wonderful resource to continue the work that they do through the arts and community service uh, mentality. So we wanna be able to use something that can continue and it's not just a consumable um, purchase or, or things that's just gonna go away. And so the kids have put a lot of thought into it. So they have pretty much three main things that they would like to work on. And I think uh, a variety is good because then it'll just continue and continue. I think with that mission, people can see that art is needed, it is powerful, and it's everywhere. You know, even if they think it might not be there, if they just pause and process, they will see it.